From the Weirton Medical Center Sports Desk, Jack Hillgrove, now with News 9 Sports. Good evening, a triple header of high school hoops tonight in Steubenville for the Watney's Classic and the nightcap between the Big Red Boys and Weir High became an instant classic. Two prolific guards in this one with freshman Santino Haney of Big Red and senior G Cross at Weir High and they did not disappoint. Weir High up two at the break, this in the third quarter. Trey Wiggins knocking down the three for the Big Red. He had nine points and that puts him up six halfway through the third, but the Red Riders would stay hot as Malachi Stromile knocks down the triple from the corner. He had 15, a four point lead for the home team heading to the fourth. And in the fourth, tied at 59, Big Red would have a chance here to win it in regulation, but the shot wouldn't fall and we'd be tied at 59 heading into OT. And in overtime, Kylie Hopkins scores on a breakaway. He had 14 points, but then Cross gets the floater to fall. 66-63, we're high, under a minute left in OT, but on the next Big Red possession, Haney step back, fouled as he shoots a three, and he would make all three from the line. We're tied at 66. After Weir would make one free throw to go up one, Haney drives, lays, and scores. He's fouled with .3 seconds left. The bucket is good. He would miss the free throw, but it wouldn't matter as Big Red wins in overtime, 68 to 67. Haney and Cross, the players of the game. Haney finishing with 21, and Cross led all scores with 41 points. What a matchup. The second game of the day, the Big Red Girls taking on the Steubenville Central Girls. The Lady Crusaders led by Ella Maragos. She knocks down the three. She had 15 points, but Big Red would get the triple working on the other end. Good step back move here from Maddie Chris. Three ball good. She had nine points as well. This one, a one point game after a quarter. Myla McShann would lead the way for the Big Red. Layup good. She led all scores with 23 as Big Red wins 57 to 29. In the first game, the Central Boys taking on Zanesville Rosecrans. Tommy Purgy gets the bucket to fall with the left hand. And then the Crusaders again on the other end. Timmy Mahalio step back three, and he would get the shooter's roll as it bounced off the rim a couple of times. Central down 18 at the half, trying to get something working here. Benji Rook driving and scoring, but Zanesville Rosecrans too much as they go on to win over Steubenville Central 76 to 44. All right, college football.